Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here. Earlier this year, I set out on a journey of painting a whole bunch of new animals, critters, and tropical goodies. Everything from frogs to primates to fruits. I painted 25 original pieces all for the creation of my newest book, Watercolor With Me in the Jungle. This is the third book in my Watercolor With Me book series and I really think that you guys are gonna love this one. If you have my other two books, you'll hopefully find these projects a little more in-depth and advanced, but they're still easy enough for beginners. Let's take a peek inside. So as I've said, I created 25 paintings for this book as opposed to the usual 50, but you're still going to get two different sections, wet on wet and wet on dry techniques. You'll find that on each of the project pages, the approach is really easy to follow with the written instructions, and you'll also learn a thing or two as you continue through the book. Once again, in this book, I've included a master color chart. I've also gone ahead and created an Amazon shop list of all of this actual supplies that I use in the book. I'm going to put the link to that in the description below so that you can easily find each of the colors of paint that I used as well as the brushes and everything else. At the beginning of the sections, you'll find the practice pages as usual, and you'll also find each of the no sketch sketches <laughs> that are already created for you on the classic watercolor with me watercolor paper. Yes, this book is printed on watercolor paper, which makes it so easy to just complete the projects within the book. Some people have liked to trace the sketch onto their own watercolor paper before going ahead and doing it within the book, which is totally fine, you can do that as well. But here is an example of the paper. It is a lighter weight cold pressed watercolor paper and it does have a bit of that texture that we all love so much. Because this book is only 25 projects compared to the 50 of my last books, it is thinner, which makes it easier to take with you wherever you go. I think that the projects in this book are going to take you a little bit longer than maybe some of the projects in the other books. So that's one reason we went with 25 projects as opposed to 50. Here you can see that the format is set up the same as the In the Ocean book with the project on the left hand side and the sketch on the right hand side. I always like to try to keep most of the detail out of the sketches because that's for you guys to put in and the instructions will show you how to do that. Watercolor With Me in the Jungle comes out on October 20th. If you're watching this video before then, you can pre-order on Amazon and it will ship right out to you as soon as it's out. I also wanted to mention that I heard from a little birdie that my In the Ocean and In the Forest books are going to be going up in price. So if you wanted to grab all three of them together, now would be the most optimal time to do so. I'm going to include links to all of the books in the description below so you can find them on Amazon or in major bookstores coming very, very soon. While I've got you here, I thought I'd also mention that my Wonder Forest watercolor brushes are also on Amazon US and Amazon Canada. You can also find them on my own store, wonderforest.com. And if you do purchase them from my own store, you can actually bundle the watercolor brush set that I'm showing you here with the wash brush and get a discount. I really hope that you guys love this book. I can't wait for its launch date. Please let me know if you get it. Tag me on Instagram at wonderforest and I'll see you guys soon.